My name is Andrea Melchiori, and uh, I was a was a little kid, a little girl in uh, the mid '70s, and it's the perfect age to watch the Six Million Dollar Man, and then soon after the Bionic Woman, and I I love the show. I love the show. I have the whole DVD set. I I love it. It, it takes me back to my childhood. Anyway. Um, during the run of the series, uh, I believe it was, and I'm not too clear on the year, maybe 76, 77, the Six Million Dollar Man came out with the Bionic Action Club, and you could order the kit through the mail. And I had seen a clipping of it, and uh, I had to send it in. I don't remember if I had to send any money in, but, uh, but this is what I got. Now my, this is the envelope, now it's, it's not in great shape, of course I played with it, but anyway, this is the envelope here. It's got my original address in that I lived at in the 70s. Yeah, that's that. And then you received a certificate acknowledging your entry into the club there, and I signed it. There's my name. And I, I believe I had it taped to my wall there. Okay, and then this is the picture that you got. Now I went to a I went to a Comic-Con last year and I had Lee sign it. And that's him, as he signed it there. And then this was like a little little card that you got, I guess, for your wallet there. And I believe I signed it there too. So anyway, that's the Bionic Action Club kit. And another uh, interesting collectible that I, that I got in the 70s. My parents had bought my brother and me the towels. Now I looked on eBay, I looked, I asked fans, nobody seemed to either remember them or can find these towels. Uh, so this is the one I had. It's not in great shape, of course I used it for the beach and, and so forth and things. And this is my brother's towel. Of course it's <laughs> not in great shape, but this is his towel. Yeah, there we go. There's his towel. You can see it there. <laughs> yep, we used to we used to lay our towels uh, side by side, and, and when we went on the beach, and so we ran over to our towels and made sure we got on the on our towel that was specific to us. You know, female, female, male, male. And uh, of course, me being the big collector, I had collected when the six million dollar man comic books came out. I had collected all of them. These are a variety of all of them. Now, I'm not too sure if they're in, in order, but these are all of them. Kind of pan them out here. There. They have a variety of different covers on. Whoops, there's a receipt there. There. You can see them all there. And ending, now I have to stick this in. And I even showed Lee Majorsis at Comic Con, and he had not heard of the Bionic Banana. <laughs> and and it, what it is actually, it is a joke book, actually. And uh, I think there's a chapter on here on the Bionic Banana. So, anyway. And that is, and, oh, and this I also I got in the 70s, believe it or not. Anyway, that's my uh, collect collectibles of my of my collectibles that are what I consider rare um, like I said I don't know of any other fans who have the towels or remember the towels and of course the Action Club um, the Six Million Dollar Man Action Club that I believe is very rare <clears throat> thank you very much again I'm Andrew Melchiori and thank you for listening to my story